What's going on guys, Wadiger here and I'm back with another video and I'm going to be showing you guys how to customize the layers of the flat world generation. So if I just go ahead and create a flat world really quick, let's name it Bob. So I'm going to create it and as you can see, uh, pretty much flat worlds are basic. So you got grass, then you got two layers of dirt, one, to, and then you got bedrock at the bottom but luckily the developers added this thing that lets you customize these layers uh, or you can also add layers if you if you want um, so pretty much I'm just gonna show you guys the iOS tutorial I'm gonna make it as easy as possible you will need a drill break so let's go right ahead and get started you're going to need I file. Uh, pretty much you could get this off Cydia so just go ahead and look it up on Cydia um, it's iFile it's a pretty simple name and once you have it just go ahead and open it up and it's gonna look like this if it doesn't uh, just go ahead and tap the home button if you're on iPhone the home button is gonna be at the bottom of the screen so once you're at the home which is which should look like no actually it's not gonna look like this um, you guys are not gonna have this file but some of you will so once it looks like something like this uh, pretty much you want to tap the little settings icon at the bottom of the screen so here it is then you want to tap file manager and then from here you want to make sure application names is turned on if it's not turned on then it's gonna make it difficult to find minecraft pocket edition so you want to make sure it's turned on just like that once you have that, tap on Applications, then find Minecraft Pocket Edition, which should be very easy because it has a name Minecraft PE. Once you have something like this, go ahead and tap Documents, Games, Combat Mojang, and then Minecraft PE. And from here, it's pretty much really, really easy. So the file you're going to edit is options.txt. And from here, you want to tap Edit. And you're going to want to look for this right here game flat world layers and then it has some numbers and these numbers are the item I or the block IDs you cannot replace those numbers with item IDs because obviously you cannot place items so they have to be block IDs and seven bedrock three the two threes are for the dirt and the number two is for the grass so you're going to want to edit those with block IDs so let's go ahead and go ahead and get to a list of block IDs. I will have the link in the description for this. This is just a picture for the 0.9.0 item IDs and block ID. So as you can see, it's pretty much pretty much has all of them, which is pretty cool. Really, really cool. And this is a picture. And this picture was made by Jacopa3. So if if you want to follow him, his link will be in the description. He's a pretty cool modder. Um, he's right now I think he's modding. Android for those of you who are on Android boom you got an awesome modder so that's pretty cool alright back to this um, pretty much you just want to replace those numbers that you saw the 7 the 3 the 3 or the 2 or you can add numbers to it um, so let's say we want a gold block which is 41 and a diamond block which is 57 so we want to remember 41 and 57 so we go back to that file options.txt we go back to those numbers and let's say we want to add them so we got four we so pretty much you if you want to add them you pretty much add a comma and then the number and then if you want to keep going you add another comma and what was the number uh, 41 and 50, we'll do 50 I think it was 53 so pretty much that's that's what it's gonna be so we're gonna have bedrock two dirt blocks a grass block a gold block and then a diamond block so you can keep going I guess um, I don't know how far you keep going I guess till you reach the height limit or something but yeah you can keep going and it's pretty legit so once you have that you want to close Minecraft Pocket Edition you cannot have it in your multitasking before you do this so you want to close it and then you open it up again and then you generate a brand new flat world and okay I guess I didn't get the diamond block correctly but you pretty much get the point and then you'll get this so I guess these are stairs so we have stairs 
a gold block. I got that part right. It's cool. And then you have a grass, and then two dirt, and then bedrock. So it's pretty legit. It's really, really cool. This causes lag though, so I guess it's because the the stair block. So anyways, it's pretty cool. Um, you can keep going, you can replace the dirt or grass or bedrock or whatever um, and replace it with a block ID. It has to be a block ID, otherwise it will just crash if you put an item ID because obviously you cannot place items down. So that's pretty much it for this video guys. Thank you all for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.